use of G10, the use of G10, if I go into offset, and you'll see work, that's the work offset that we've got in there, 61.337. So if I go to my program, if I switch to auto, switch to edit, okay, and then I'm going to go, just clear that, I'm going to go into my um, custom graphics, this means guide eye. That's the custom graphics, guide eye, that one. And then at the beginning of this program, I'm going to type in G10, L2, shift L2, and the P1 means it's right into G54, so I'm going to have a P1, and then I'll always put an X0 just to make sure it zeroes off the X, and the Z, which I can't remember what it was, I'll just insert that, move back to my offset so I can see what it was, 61.337, 61.337, so I'm going to go there, and change that 61.337 alter. So what that'll effectively do now is right to that offset. I'm just going to close the door. Close the door. I'm in the auto mode. Switch to memory. Just wind my wrap it down just in case. I've got a single block into my program here just rewind that oh thanks in the offset zero input and then i'll switch back to program and as i press my cycle start there you'll see that offset go in so it should be reading that first line of code read and it's gone in but that's how that g10 L2 P1 words. In the program, that's what it's just read. G10 means I'm going to write something, it could be offsets, tall lens, whatever. L2 means it's the work offsets, and P1 corresponds to G54, so if you put P2, it would be 55 and so on. Look in your offsets, you've got 54, 55, 56, 7, 8, and 9. So you could have 1 to 6 in there and write to whichever offset you want to. Right. Go on then you do it so from your program press your position button and then what you want to press then is your relative button from that relative screen you'll see u and w which correspond to x and z okay now they've actually got values in them they've actually been zero but if you was to now press u so press the u key and you'll see down there you'll see your origin button yeah origin now you can either do all axes which will do u and w yeah, or you could press execute which would just do that if you want to put a preset value in all you do now is just type u yeah and put one point and then if you press the preset button that's written that in there okay so if you do it again now to origin the u press u yeah origin and just press execute which will just do you yeah all execute or execute so that's origin and that display doesn't do anything it's yours for the taking so the machine doesn't look at it the machine just looks at the other displays